Today we are going to configure Meta Alarm component. What Meta Alarm is? Meta Alarm is a severe weather warning system for the European Union or uh, European region. So what is Meta Alarm? Meta Alarm is a severe weather warning system for the Europe. It includes some non-European Union countries and it can give you a severe and extreme weather condition alarms across the European Union. I use it in such a way that if there is any uh, severe weather or extreme weather condition warning in my region, I receive notification on my smartphone. In order for it to work, you have to select country you are interested in, for example, Austria or Cyprus, uh, Ireland, Macedonia or Italy. So any country here can do. Then you have to click on that country and you have to select your region. So as you can see, there are a couple of regions that are green, but region where I live has yellow warning condition and we will select it. Why? Because we need this uh, name, uh, region name. So my region name is Zagreb Space Regia and this will be used in the configuration file to configure it. If we would, for example, go to I don't know, Poland and select I don't know, this region, in order for you to configure Poland Plutski region, you would have to select country Poland and region Plutski. Okay, let's start configuring now. First, we will head back to our Home Assistant installation. Since we already have Configurator here, we will open it. So here is our configuration file. And in configuration file, we will make a binary sensor uh, definition here. And we will tell uh, Home Assistant that we will be keeping binary sensor information in external files. So binary sensor include binary sensor YAML. We are done here. Now we need to create a new file. Uh, let us just check where we are. Okay. Let us go to configuration and in the folder where we are keeping all our uh, home assistant configuration files, we will create new file and we will call this file binary sensor YAML. Okay, so now we have a new file. Let's open that file. And inside that file, we will create configuration for the meta alarm. And that configuration is pretty simple. We just have to define platform and uh, give it information about country and province we are interested in. Let's give this first comment, meteo alarm. Now let's define platform meteo alarm country is you have to use two letter definition for country so for Croatia it's HR and we now have to define last thing that is a province and as I said mine is Zagreb Regia, Zagreb region. Okay, and more or less this is it for the Meta Alarm component. We can now restart our check configuration, of course, and restart our server. Okay, let's wait for the server to restart. And our server is back online. We still do not have information from the Tado. Doesn't matter. Let us go to weather. Um, I have disabled my uh, Zigbee sensors because I'm using it at my non-test environment. And here we will add new entity. Save. Okay. And as you can see, 
we already have unsafe condition because today we are having a fog warning. And it says that, yeah, of course, we are in unsafe condition, yellow fog, fog warning, urgency future, moderate, and certainty is likely. And this is the, uh, what are the effective uh, dates when something will happen. And you have here instructions and description of the event. As I said, I use it in my automations in such a way that when condition changes from safe to something else, I get notified on my smartphone via Telegram. I hope you like this brief video on how to configure Meta Alarm component. If you have any kind of question or comment, please leave it down in the description. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. If you still haven't subscribed, please do subscribe and hit the bell button so you get notified on future updates. And I will be seeing you in the next video. Until then, bye bye and have fun.